Hello everyone, it's Nathan here from Melbourne Regional Train Vlogs. Today I am doing my first review video and like what they always say, every single time I buy a new model they're going to review it and that's what I'm exactly going to be doing today. And today, after four really long months, I am going to be reviewing this. So this is the Oxygen Models B Class diesel electric locomotive. Oxygen have put their time and effort in for this model. As you can see. Okay. It is B60 in the VR blue and gold original. And let's get into the box. Normal box for every decision model. And we come into the instructions and the exploded diagram of all the parts. And the features. This time it's double sided because this is. You can get an option of DCC sound, but I got DC because I don't run DCC. Yeah, I'm just trying to put the instructions back in properly. It's a bit hard. I'll fix it later. Let's put it over here. There we go. And we come to the phone. And then we have model sitting in the block of ice, which is what it's usually called by a YouTuber I know. And it looks like it's very snug in there, as you can see it's B60. Let's get into the box. Yeah. Bit tight. It's one of these ones, the ones that I'm pretty sure the A's are in. Put them all over here. And so this is the Sister Models B class. As you can see, sorry about this, it is numbered B60. Very nice crisp paint job. And from what I see, they've done the same thing what they did with the A's, and there's only two drivers in one end. They haven't put one in this end. It doesn't really bother me that much. 
So now we'll go into some history and the features. So now let's read off the features page. So the B class is it has the following: a state-of-the-art five-pulse skewer motor designed specifically for scissor models. It's got twin brass flywheels, oil drive and electrical pickup, metal and plastic handrails, see-through metal etched grills, detailed cab interior with painted driver and fireman figures only on this end. There's not one in that end. Uh, it has operating red and white marker lights. At both ends, operating headlights and number boxes, three micro micro switches on the chassis to operate the lights on DC, which is under the fuel tank right here. It has a, um it has black and metal wheels, as you can see. Scale size metal knuckle coppers uh, with knuckle knuckle spring, which is the generic decision coupling. They are factory painted and they are factory painted and decorated with laser sharp printing, which which looks very nice. And it has a TCC ready with 21 pin circuit on the DC version, which is what mine is. Um, I'm not gonna go into any of the sound features because I haven't got a DC model. So now we're going some of the history. So the B class were the first mainline diesel locomotives built for the Victorian Railways. Their design was based off the successful electro electromotive diesel F units in America with their distinctive bulldog nose. Um, Twenty six members were operated on broad gauge lines working throughout Victoria, and later in the in nineteen. 83 or between 1983 and 1984 um, If I can find it I think if I go to the A class page on Wikipedia, sorry about this So 11 B classes were rebuilt into A classes which were slightly more powerful and were used in V-Line's fleet and so far two have been preserved which are A60 which used to be B60 and A62 is also preserved so A60 is preserved by the Seymour Railway Heritage Centre and A62 is preserved by 707 Operations a70 is currently stored using spare parts for A66 which has been brought back into service after two years in storage and yeah that's basically it so let's go to the layout. 